Ask me what I know. I tell you what I know. I know the customer is usually wrong. Yeah. And before we finish this up, can you just tell me how you heard about the theater, please? How I heard about the theater? Are you serious? I've been coming to this theater since it opened back in 1875. I was one of the first customers, patrons, okay, to ever walk into that theater and see a show. They did this show. It was an amazing show back in the day. It was called, what was it called? Um, 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 it was, ooh, I can't seem to remember the name. It was a great show written by a local playwright, by the way. Wonderful. Whose mother Wonder I used to go to school with, and he did an amazing job. It was a great story about forgiveness and redemption and making sure you forgive people who've done you wrong, even no matter how bad it was. I think the name of it was called Forgiveness. It could have been Forgiveness, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, I've been going there for a very long time, and I remember... I'm bringing my children there, especially when they do the children's theater. And, um, and every time my sisters and my siblings come to visit for the holidays, we always been going to that theater ever since then. And I remember one well, year, one year they did the amazing job. This man from New York City, I believe it was, wrote this musical. He wanted to be on Broadway, so what he did was he performed it actually at that theater, and he invited Broadway producers to come see it. That's great. And um, they that's, didn't really like that's... it. I liked it. It was such a great show. It never really made it to Broadway. I think he went to off Broadway instead, but it was a great show, an amazing show. It was a musical. It had great sound and music, and the singing was amazing, and the costumes, oh my goodness, you should have seen the costumes. The costumes were just the Amazing. And then I remember one Christmas, they did this Christmas show instead of taking, you know, how every year most theaters do the same Christmas shows over and over again, like Christmas Carol and the same ones. They decided to write their own Christmas Thank show. You. Yes, and it was amazing. It was like a lifetime movie, actually. It was just so heartwarming. I cried during the entire thing. But there was a comedy in it, too. It was funny. Thank you. The name of the show was called Jingle Bells Up My Bell. I'm not really sure. Right. I can't remember. So if it was you... a while ago. But I also remember when the theater um, had an art show. They had um, opened up, they have like this special room where they opened up and they and had visual and fine artists come in and they had all these great paintings all over the place. I tell you, it was amazing. You should have been there. You should have seen it. Oh, and then I remember one time when they had um, this 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 so, um, a film celebrity. They did a Q and A with him. Like, the customer is usually wrong. Like everyone in the neighborhood was talking about how great this film was. Sorry, but no food or beverage is allowed inside the theater. Oh no, I'm not going to open it. <laughs> I guess that means you're going to be sitting out here in the lobby with an unopened bottle of water and an unopened bag of pretzels. Oh, come on, man. The show's about to start. Well, then I guess that means you better hurry up and eat it. <laughs> man, come on, please. Uh, uh um... I don't have it anymore. I'm ready to go in. <laughs> the customer is usually wrong. Thank you for calling the Pack Theater. This is Ivana speaking. How may I help you? Yeah, I want to buy tickets for the show. Pick up the pieces of paper from off the floor. Please. I believe you have the wrong theater. We do not have that performance here. Are you sure? I saw in the newspaper that that show was coming to a theater near me. You probably misunderstood. We're not doing that show here. Do you know where it's playing? I'm not sure, sir. Well, what you can do is you can, you can search it online. Oh, go ahead and search it online for me then. Go right ahead. I can wait. Sure, 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 sure. I, 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 I can do that for you. Hold on, let me just. 
Okay, let's see here. The, okay, so yes, they are playing at the Old Time Theater in Proverbs, New Jersey. Oh, okay. Um, so what's their phone number? Can you give me the phone number so I can call them? Sure, sure, of course. Uh, their phone number is 777-555-5555. Three, three. But I called that phone number, didn't I? No, you, you, you called the pack theater. Oh, well, what's your phone number then, if I didn't call it? Our phone number is 444-333-1111. Four, 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 three, 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 one, 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 one. So is this the theater doing the show? No, 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 no. The old time theater, they're the ones, they're the ones doing that show. Oh, oh. So can you give me the phone number, please? Their, their, yes. Their number is 777-555-3333. Didn't I call that number? N no, you, you call the PAC Theater. You're going to want to call that number to get the Old Time Theater to see that show. So is this the theater doing the show? That would be the Old Time Theater, sir. Isn't this the old time theater I'm talking to now? No, sir. This is, you call it the Pack Theater. So this isn't the old time theater? No, sir. Listen, we are the Pack Theater. We are not, we're not doing that show. You need to call the old time theater. So then what's that number? The, the, the number 777-555-3333 is the phone number for the old time theater. You're going to want to hang up and dial that phone number. Okay, sir? Oh, okay. All right. Thank you, babies. All right. Have a good day. Hi, thank you for calling the Pack Theater. Yvonne is speaking. How may I help you? Yes, babies. Is this the old time theater? The customer is usually wrong. Ask me what I know, I'll tell you what I know, I know the customer is usually wrong.